Eighty years ago this week, the U.S. staged the first test of an atomic explosive held in the New Mexican desert on July 16, 1945. This was a test of a plutonium weapon, the same weapon type that devastated Nagasaki several weeks later. To remember this event, the National Security Archive has published a special posting of declassified documents on the test and its environmental impact. Besides documents, it includes photos and period films, along with eyewitness accounts. Published for the first time is Manhattan Project Director General Leslie Groves' phoned-in report on the test minutes after it occurred. Groves reported estimates of the test explosive force made by onlookers, including J.R. Oppenheimer, who guessed that it was over 21 kilotons of TNT. The first nuclear explosion had an impact beyond its military, scientific, and political importance. The radioactive fallout contaminated over 1,100 square miles of the state of New Mexico, with debris spreading as far north as Canada. Declassified documents in this posting include studies by UCLA on Trinity's radioactive dispersal. The studies drew no firm conclusions but a 1951 report found many potential long-term insidious hazards from the present low-level contamination. The public health implications of the Trinity test continue to be discussed and debated to this very day.